Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new here. Today I am doing a very, very quick video, planning on filming it, editing it, uploading it this afternoon. It's obviously Love Island final tonight, which I'm super excited for, so I'm going to try and get it up before that. So if you are watching this, you can tell by the title that this is like a wardrobe clear out and Depop haul type video. So I'm going to make it fairly speedy. The reason being is that I was going to do a really in-depth going through my wardrobe with me, but to be completely honest with you, I listed every everything on Depop last night, not intending on things selling as quickly as they are. So I thought, just a quick video just to like introduce you guys to my Depop, which is just Freya Farrington. I've listed about 75 items, I think about 10 have already sold. So I didn't want you guys to miss out who were waiting for this video, which I've been talking about for ages. Everything is under £10 and prices start from around £3. So you have to be quick because like I said, they are selling out, hence why I wanted to get this video uploaded for you guys today. I'm just going to run through a couple of the items just to kind of like briefly show you what it is that I am selling. I have a big tub in front of me and also a clothes rail with like different coats and things hung up so I'm probably just going to leave them and just show you guys a few things in the tub. So the first one a Balmain top which is brand new unworn I've just never worn it I've never gone to it so I figured why not sell it so it's just like a standard white vest top in extra small we also have this which was a really popular like cropped jumper style thing from Pretty Little Thing I will say a lot of the items on there are like misguided boohoo Pretty Little Thing hence the reason why everything is so affordable on there so I really really like this I honestly I'm sad to be parting with it, but I just have that many clothes that I've been ruthless and gone through everything and I don't want to start doubting and pulling things out, so I'm just going to go through these rapid. We have this little white crochet style play suit. I think I got this from Missy Empire. I've never actually worn it again, but because the labels have been taken out, it's not brand new with tags, but it is like new. Just a cute little play suit. It's got a cut out back as well. Really pretty detailing on this. So again, sad to be parting with it, but it's gotta be done. There's also padding that can be removed from like the booberry so you can go braless with this comfortably with the back being backless. I have a little dress here from Zara, which I've featured on my Instagram before, so I have worn this out once. It's been washed and everything since, but obviously by all means you can rewash it, but yeah, it just probably needs an iron to be honest with you. So I love Zara, there are a few Zara bits on there as well. This has already been sold actually, this is the Breakfast Club tee from Joni Clothing, which has been seen on Zoe Sub recently. As has this been sold, it's the Primark suit, so I'm just going to put that to one side and post that out this morning. We also have this little jumpsuit, uh, play suit, no more so jumpsuit from Misguided. Really, really pretty. It's like a strappy, kind of double layered play suit, as you can tell there, in a size 8, and it goes into like a wide, like culotte style cropped bottom. So I wore this as a t-shirt dress. It is in a large, but like I said, I wanted it oversized with cycling shorts. So it is, again, dependent on like your desired fit. And it's really, really nice fabric and material, which is very different for Boohoo. We have a cute little in the style Sarah Ashcroft mix and match bikini, which again, I don't think I've ever worn this. It's got a little babe on the bum. So I figured I would sell it. It's not got the labels anymore. I wore this Topshop body. It's really, really pretty this. And it's got like this gorgeous like embroidery and sequin detailing on the front and mesh on the back. I wore it to the races at Aintree last time I went there. I'm going to uh, Haydock races again next or in two weeks time. So really looking forward to that. But I'm going to obviously change it up and wear a different outfit. So I don't know if I'm going to get any more use out of that one. So that is for you guys. Really pretty dress dress from Joni Clothing again, it just doesn't quite suit me. It's quite like heavy duty thick, like really good material, button down at the front, nice midi length there and it also has a kind of like bardo off the shoulder style. So very pretty, very like retro vintage-y, typical Joni Clothing style. This top I really like, this is from Misguided. Again, I, I think I wore this once, it's kind of like a shimmery fabric. Uh, crop top, nice for like a night out with maybe some white high-waisted jeans. Similar kind of vibe, it's got the high neck, ribbed, beige, and it's got like a wraparound detail around the waist, which I really like to kind of dress up a little bit with like high-waisted white trousers for like dinner out, something like that. I also have this little beach dress from DKNY in this like beige crochet kind of design. 
I'm really, I'm not sad to be parting with this because otherwise I wouldn't sell it, but I do feel like I just don't get the use out of it, especially in this country. I mean, for a holiday dress it would be really nice as well, but as you can tell, it is just a cute, I think for me it's maybe a little bit short and that's probably why I'm more inclined to sell it, because it is only an extra small, um, so it just comes up a lit. it does cover my bum, but for me I'm preferring slightly longer styles now, so that is uh, on sale for you guys. We have a couple of pairs of like beige nude kind of trousers from Pretty Little Thing, both brand new and worn with tags. And this is another favourite of mine which again I'm sad to be selling. I wore this to uh, Italy when we went to Sorrento as like an airport outfit. It is the stone Pretty Little Thing jogger set. This cute little bandage skirt, I actually got a really bad picture of this so sorry about that. But um, as you can tell it is like a high-waisted mini skirt in this like stretchy bandage material. Really, really good fabric this one. Highly recommend. Again, it's just because it's a mini style, I'm just not wearing minis that often. So uh, that one's really affordable. I've got a couple of satin duster coats, some from the Carly Bible range, and then there's this gold one again from Misguided. We have this cute cropped sweat which says Boy Bye. I absolutely love the font of this, and it's a really, really soft, nice fabric as well. So it says it's a large, but again, it's one of those tops that's like, I would say one size because completely dependent on your desired fit, it could fit like a size six, it could fit a size 14 and it's just how you want it to fit but on me it's like a little cropped white jumper. Again another cropped more so beige kind of jumper or creamy beige is this. It's kind of got like slight bell sleeves. It's got this really nice knit ribbed fabric. Again I quite like this with like white jeans. Okay so I think that is everything I'm going to show you in this video but do be sure to head over to my Depop which I've said is has got loads more things on it. About 75 items. I'll do maybe try and insert a little screen showing you some of the different items that I've got just so you guys can have more of an idea of what is for sale on my Depop. So again, it is just Freya Farrington, prices start from £3, everything is under £10. Do be sure to ask me any questions that you might have about any of the items, either in the comments or over on my Depop. And happy shopping! Thank you so much for watching and I will see you again next time. Bye guys!